hello guys psp mao here and in this video i'll be showing you guys how to convert and watch any kind of videos on your psp now i had previously made a video on this topic but the application which i had used was pretty limited in terms of features like it lacked the support for x265 videos and had no option to add the subtitles so this will be more like an update over the same topic so the first thing you need to do is connect your PSP to your PC. Once you're on your PC, go to the link in the description. From here download the application. And once the application has been downloaded, install it as an administrator. So once the application has been installed, open it and choose the video which you would like to convert. Once you choose your video, you will get 7 different tabs like this. And in the first tab that is the summary tab, you go to untick all the first 3 options. Then go to the next tab that is the dimensions tab. Here you got to change the anamorphic from automatic to none. Then untick keep aspect ratio and change the width to 480 and height to 272. After changing that go to the filters tab. Now in this tab you don't have to change anything keep it keep everything to the default values and go to the next tab that is the video tab here you go to change the encoder profile to baseline and the encoder level to auto also make sure the video codec is set to h264 after doing that go to the next tab that is the audio tab here you can choose the language of your choice now this option is applicable only if your video comes with multiple languages and you can change the bitrate to any value of your choice once you do that go to the next tab that is the subtitles tab here you can choose the subtitle and once you select your subtitle, disable forest only and click on burning. Once you do that, go to the chapters tab and select the location for the output video. and then click on save once you have selected the output location click on start encode one hour later So once the conversion has been completed, copy the converted video to the videos folder on your PSP.
and that's all for today's video thank you guys for watching and make sure to subscribe for more awesome psp content